Um, so let's start from the from the top, I suppose. So, Jessie, tell me about how you got the job and the audition. Um, well, I left drama school um, when I was 29, because I only went... I started when I was in my 20s. And uh, I left, got a small part in the bill as a policewoman. <laughs> <laughs> really? <laughs> PC Karen Lace. <laughs> You're Reg Hollis. Yeah, that's right, yeah. Um... I do know your face. A few months later, uh, I got a phone call from my agent saying that it was workshopping a family for EastEnders. And I don't think I'd ever done that before, workshopped a family. And so I went there, did the um, workshop with Elaine Lauden, Casey <laughs> Ainsworth, Mo, Brooke Kinsella, who oh, they wanted yes. as, the, as the original Zoe, Johnny Harris, who's now a film star. <laughs> yes, yeah, so we did all these improvisations and then I got called back and uh, Tony Jordan was there. He created this latest, didn't he? Yeah. Yeah. And then a few months later, I got the call saying that I'd got it. And I was walking down the street when I got the phone call and I nearly passed out. It was just <laughs> the most amazing feeling. Our first scene was when we come in the van as a family, we've been moving into the square. Uh, we're looking for, what's it called again? You don't even know, Albert Square. Of course it is, sorry, um, Albert Square. And I had a walkie-talkie in my hand from the crew and they, they gave me the sign and then, and then we talked. But it was in shot, and you can see my hand going like this with the walkie-talkie. The area was going like that. <laughs> <laughs> Should be. I think you'll be well taken care of, guys. It's not me coming to live here, is it?